coldest knockouts by female fighters, women dominating in fighting. While women's boxing might not enjoy the same level of popularity as men's boxing, it's important to recognize that talent and skill know no gender boundaries. Women boxers showcase impressive abilities and can craft combinations that leave their opponents in shock. Let's dive into the thrilling world of women's boxing and witness some of the most spectacular knockouts. These moments not only demonstrate the fierce competitiveness in women's boxing, but also highlight the undeniable skill and power that female fighters bring to the ring. So, buckle up for a journey through the wildest knockouts in women's boxing that prove these athletes are an unstoppable force in the ring. In the intense world of professional boxing, Ava Knight showcased her prowess in a memorable match against Arlie Muxino in 2011. Throughout her impressive 26-fight career, Knight, with five knockouts under her belt, delivered a knockout victory against Muxino that sent shivers down the audience's spine. The bout, where the IBF flyweight title was at stake, began with a competitive first round as both fighters exchanged punches. Yet, Knight's efficiency and accurate hits to Muxino's chin stood out. Her body shots also inflicted considerable damage. The second round witnessed Knight maintaining her aggression, pressing Muxino against the ropes. About halfway through the round, Knight executed a powerful body-head combination that brought Muxino to the canvas. Though Muxino quickly recovered, Knight didn't let up, landing stinging punches to her opponent's midsection. The climax came when Knight delivered a left hook that turned off Muxino's lights, sealing a spectacular victory. Back in 2011, when Yelena Mirjinovic took on Olivia Garula, things were a bit shaky for her. She had lost five out of her last seven matches and only joined in as a last-minute replacement. Originally, another fighter was set to face Olivia for the Waiba featherweight title but had to back out due to an injury. Despite the odds stacked against her, Mirjinovic put on a tough performance. She went toe-to-toe -to -toe with Garula for eight rounds in a fierce battle. Then, in round 9, with 23 seconds in, she pulled off one of the most terrifying knockouts in women's boxing history. Even though Mirjinovic was leading on the scorecards, it didn't matter. In that round, she landed a perfectly placed left hook to Garula's temple, and the champion hit the canvas face down, knocked out cold for several minutes. It was an unforgettable moment in women's boxing. Get ready for an epic showdown as Amanda Serrano gears up to face Maria Moderna. Amanda, often considered one of the best boxers ever, has an incredible track record, holding the record for the most championships won in various weight classes by a female. With 30 victories and 44 fights under her belt, she's an unstoppable force. In a memorable clash back in 2014, Serrano showcased her finishing skills in a WBO female lightweight title fight against Maria Moderna. Despite the hostile crowd in Buenos Aires, Argentina, Amanda remained focused and dominated the hometown hero for five intense rounds. With lightning fast speed and powerful punches, Serrano left Moderna battered. By the sixth round, Moderna was in bad shape and took a solid right hook that dropped her. As soon as Moderna got back on her feet, she signaled to the referee to stop the fight, acknowledging she couldn't handle any more of Amanda's legendary Puerto Rican power. It was a defining moment in Serrano's impressive career. In an exciting clash between Choi Hyun Mi and Simona De Silva, the South Korean powerhouse marked her comeback with a remarkable victory after almost six years without a stoppage win. The WBA junior lightweight title fight in 2021 showcased Choi's dominance as she controlled the match from the get-go. With eight title defenses under her belt, Choi was the clear favorite against the Brazilian fighter. Right from the opening bell, the difference in skill was apparent as the North Korean defector skillfully used her jab to dictate the pace. She strategically threw straight rights and left hooks, keeping De Silva on her toes. Although De Silva had a moment of success in the seventh round, where she managed to string together some effective combinations, Choi regained control in the eighth round. The turning point came when Choi delivered a powerful left hook to De Silva's body, forcing her to take a knee and securing a triumphant victory. In a thrilling match between Zulina Munoz and Vanessa Taborda, Munoz, a seasoned professional boxer with an impressive record of 60 fights, showcased her skills as one of the greatest boxers of all time. 
defending her WBC female super flyweight title. Munoz faced Taborda, who entered the ring with a seven-fight losing streak, making her the underdog. Munoz dominated from the start, landing a powerful left hook that shipped Taborda in the first round. Despite Taborda's resilience, Munoz controlled the fight until the third round, when Taborda surprised everyone by knocking Munoz down with a left hook. Munoz, however, recovered before the 10 counts, enduring until the end of round 4. In the fifth round, Munoz strategically chose her shots, patiently setting up an overhand right that sent Taborda to the canvas. The crowd erupted in applause, and within seconds, the referee declared Munoz the winner, solidifying her position among the elite in women's boxing. In a recent showdown between rising boxing stars Julissa Guzman and Ramla Ali from Britain, the bout took an unexpected turn. Initially, Ali showed promise, winning the first two rounds in their battle for the WBA Continental America's Super Bantamweight belt. However, Guzman's strength and precision became evident in the fifth round, where she landed a powerful blow, sending Ali to the canvas for a 10-8 round. Round 6 also favored Guzman, but Ali managed to come back in the seventh, sparking hope among her fans. Unfortunately, in the eighth round, an exchange of blows concluded with a decisive short left hook from Guzman that ended Ali's undefeated record. The British fighter couldn't recover, and she went down, bringing the match to a close. When it comes to women's boxing, Clarissa Shields stands out as the absolute best. She proudly calls herself the GOAT, greatest of all time, in women's boxing, and her record backs it up. As a two-time Olympic gold medalist, she has not only proven herself on the grandest stage, but has also clinched multiple championships in professional boxing. In just her fourth professional bout, Shields demonstrated her dominance by claiming two major boxing titles from Nikki Adler. Throughout the match, Shields maintained control, showcasing her skills in each round. She stunned Adler with a left hook in the first, targeted her midsection in the second, and delivered powerful shots to the head in the fourth. By the fifth round, Shields sealed the deal by hitting Adler squarely in the face with a decisive right, followed by a series of potent punches that left her defenseless. The referee had no option but to end the fight, solidifying Clarissa Shields' status as the undisputed champion in women's boxing. Let's dive into the Cineasa Estrada vs. Miranda Atkins bout, a match that marked the fastest knockout in women's boxing history. Many saw it as a bit of an uneven contest, with the undefeated rising star Anissa Estrada delivering a 7-second performance. Facing off against 42-year-old mom Miranda Atkins, who, despite her 11-year age difference, bravely accepted the challenge on short notice to, as they say, test herself. Well, that turned out to be a not-so-bright idea. Atkins had only started her boxing journey three years prior to stepping into the ring with Estrada, boasting a 5-0 professional record. The experience gap was visible right from the start of the fight, as Estrada swiftly closed in, waited a moment, and then unleashed a flurry of punches on her somewhat stunned and stationary opponent. The result? Atkins found herself knocked out in a matter of seconds. To put it mildly, this wasn't much of a fight at all. As we end today's video, we eagerly await your feedback and thoughts about the content we presented. Your opinion matters greatly to us, so don't hesitate to share it in the comment section below. If you enjoyed watching this video and found it valuable, we would greatly appreciate it if you could show your support by giving us a thumbs up. Also, consider subscribing to our channel to stay updated with our latest content. If you find the information we provide useful, don't forget to share this video with your friends and family so they can benefit from it too. Make sure to press the bell icon to receive notifications about our upcoming videos. Until then, stay tuned, take care, and thank you for being a part of our community. Community.